Hello, welcome back to my channel. My name's Olivia and today I am bringing you some great motherhood content. For those of you who don't know me, I am a mother of two. I have a two and a half year old son and I have a one year old daughter. And I'm here to talk to you today about their Easter baskets. And I am super excited this year because my son seems to understand the concept of Easter and understands the concept of an egg hunt. So we are super excited to give him a basket this year from the bunny. And we are also super excited to um, watch him find the eggs in our yard. So the Easter Bunny did contact me and asked me to load my son's basket and my daughter's basket today with some goodies. And I'm going to show it to you guys on what the bunny had asked me to put in it. So here we have his basket. His name's Owen. So I found him this little Owen tag from personalizationmall.com. For those who haven't heard of that company, it's all online. It's personalized stuff. It's amazing, I love it. And I made him this basket here. It's just a plain white basket from Target that I put some ribbon around, nice little bow. Super cute, right? So first, we are going to start with Owen's basket. And he's a huge Buzz fan. So I had to, to pick him up this coloring book right here for it so he can color Woody and Buzz all day long. Next, I also got him this Poke the Dot book. And he is a huge fan of this book series. For those who haven't, they have so many different kinds of books and he had a farmer book with the all the barnyard animals so we figured we'd give him one for the ocean but they have tons of different themes they have cars they have animals they have ever every theme i was seeing on amazon so i just ordered this from amazon it came in so it's the ocean book so i'm gonna put that right there okay and for those who don't know it's like a book that you pop so it like you can pop the bubbles I don't know, it's, it's fun even for me, so I can't imagine how much fun he would have. So I'm gonna put that there. I also got him a box of chocolate chip cookies because what two and a half year old would not love his own box of chocolate chip cookies. Also love this brand, partakes a, a little bit cleaner of a brand, so makes me feel a little bit better at putting that in his basket. I got him a bag of Pipcorn cheese balls and a bag of Pipcorn, almost like churro bites. Figured it'd be a good healthier snack for him that in there. It was too hard decorating, not looking at it, so that's why I moved it around. I also got this bubble wand from Target. It's just a cute little carrot. My kids love bubbles. What two and a half year old doesn't? So putting that in there as well. I just can't wait to see his reaction when he sees this basket. Um, I tried not to load it with candy too much because the, the eggs that we hide in the yard will be filled with candy. But still, I had to put some sweet things in there so he would know. Um, also got him this Camelback um, cup right here. It has like little a little fox flying a little plane. My son's obsessed with airplanes. It's, it's like the cutest thing. He'll look outside and point at the sky and say airplane. It's just, it melts my heart. So I got him this cup. I figured he'd love that. Put that in there. I also had to get him some peeps because it's Easter. What child will not be getting peeps in their Easter basket? And I also got him this thing, some Dollar Tree, Dollar Tree Family Dollar, one of the two. And it's just like little M&Ms, little pastel M&Ms. So he'll get a little bit of a candy fix. As well as this cute little bag was from Dollar Tree as well. And I filled it with these little tiny chocolate eggs. So just little chocolate eggs. My son loves chocolate. So I figured he loved that as well. And then last but not least, I have some sidewalk chalk for him. Figured we'd have fun with this outside. It looks like it's going to be nice in New Jersey this weekend for Easter. So figured I would grab that as well. So this is his finished product right here. Super cute. I mean, I know it's not an Easter basket filled with Stanley Cups and Starbucks gift cards, but he's two and a half and... You know, we're trying to keep it more simple for our kids than extravagant. Not knocking those who are making it extravagant, but I know my son. I know he'll be thrilled with this basket. So, next we have my daughter. And she's a year old. Her name's Adeline. And she's just a wild personality. So, we're super excited for Easter for her, too. And we got, got some great additions for her basket. So, this is her basket. It's also it's a pink basket from Target. I got her a pink tag as well from Personalization Mall. And I also decorated it with little flowers. It's sort of so cute and little ribbons. I 
growing up had a basket like this that my mom decorated and it was so beautiful. And I really tried to recreate that for my daughter. Um, I mean, even as an adult, I would look at my basket and be like, wow, she did a great job with that. So I'm hoping that Adeline one day looks at this basket and is like, wow, mom really, really put a lot of effort in here. So for her basket, I got her some books. So we got Honey Bunny book and Little Lamb, Where Are You? She loves books right now. So I'm super excited to give her those. I also got her a little soccer ball. My husband is a fantastic soccer player and really is pushing our kids to like it too. And so far, it seems like she has more of the wild personality that would be into that. So we got her the tiniest little soccer ball. Um, she's probably gonna be walking soon, so we figured she'd be kicking that around. Of course, it's pink because she's a little girl, so had to accommodate that. I also got her this little tiny kitty cat. Um, I figured, it, I mean, it's a cute little kitty cat purse and a little cat inside. What one-year-old would not love that? We have a little white dog. Um, we don't have a cat, so it'll be cute to see her have her own little kitty cat. I also got her a Camelback cup as well. This one has little rainbow unicorns on it. It's a little pink cup. She's not at drinking out of this yet, but I figured I was grabbing one for him. I might as well add two to my cart so that way when she is ready to start drinking out of one of them, she'll have it. Also got her a bubble wand because you can't have too many of them in my house. I kid you not, we go through bubbles around here like it's no one's business. It's insane. It's insane. And then for snacks for her, she loves these little, I know they're not, they're not the cleanest, but she loves the little mini waffles. Um, this one's pumpkin, apple, and cinnamon, and this one is butternut berry. So I grabbed some of them for her. Um, you know, she's, I'm sure she's going to be having some chocolate, Ellen's chocolate as well, but I figured I'd get her, use the opportunity to get her some cute little um, baby snacks, as well as freeze-dried strawberries right from Target. She loves freeze-dried fruit, and I feel good about giving it to her. It's clean. So, I'm just throwing that in there as well. Let's see if I can get this home. Okay. And then, the last two little things. I got her a little pink and purple duck. I think it was from the dollar store. But I thought that that would be cute in the bathtub. Owen has a firefighter yellow duck, so I figured she'd be happy to have her own little pink and purple one. And then a cute little pink bunny. I mean... You can't have too much pink in a little girl's Easter basket, in my opinion. You just can't. So I'm gonna sit, sit the bunny rabbit right on top of the, the duck and I will show you her finished product. I love it. I'm telling you, I can't wait. I have been looking forward to celebrating holidays with my kids before they were even born. Uh, my mom always did such a good job at making holidays a big deal making Christmas and Easter so much fun. And it was so much more than just about the gifts. It was about just the whole entire day. So I'm excited to bring that into my house as an adult, being a mom myself. So hopefully my kids love their baskets and the Easter egg hunt and everything the bunny brings them. And thank you for checking in with me today. It was great having you. Please like and subscribe if you haven't already. Comment on this video if you think I should add anything else special to my kids' Easter baskets or if you have any recommendations yourself. But thank you guys, and I hope everyone has a very, very happy Easter.